This is 100 watts and a wire. Well, let me show you a different uh, way of hooking it up. So, oops, crash, bang, Good here Lord. we go. <laughs> here we go. <laughs> so, I just pulled this antenna down. It was up in ah. the air, and uh, I just pulled it down. So, here is a 4 to 1 balance. This is an off center fed dipole, but this doesn't matter. This could be a 1 to 1 balance or anything. But so we have the eyes here, and the the wires turned around, and this wire coming out here is coming out of the ballon, but I used wire nuts. Mm -hmm. Just You just twist it together, put the wire nuts on there, and away you go. Simple. You don't need to solder. And, uh, and just uh, put the strain relief is on here, and then your electrical connection is here. So there's these MFJ uh, balance, which work great. Now... What Joe was talking about, the wire hanging or with the tuning that he was running into, sorry for all the banging here, was, so here's an insulator at the end, and then you got the wire hanging down. And what's happened is you put a couple of wraps on and you think, okay, I'm going to tune it. Well, this wire also acts as part of the antenna. Mm -hmm. So what you need to do is you need to bring it all the way around because RF actually floats it, it rides on the surface of the of the wire, so now you have your your end of your antenna is right here where my index finger is. So uh, when you're uh, tuning antenna, wrap all your wi your excess wire back onto itself, and that will help you. It will help you on your tuning. For complete episodes, subscribe where you get podcasts and click the bell here on YouTube for features and live streams.